What's up? This is MIDI Mix Master and in this video I'm going to show you how to make simple drum beats using virtual instruments in Mixcraft 5. First of all, choose the project and um, here we have, two, we have two instrument tracks and we're going to enable drum for track 1, drums, and let's choose a nice drum kit. Um, let's, in this case, let's, let's choose Electronic kit, and let's show musical track, musical typing, uh, so that this is for those who don't have MIDI control keyboards. Um, so here you can use uh, your uh, computer keyboard uh, for this. So let's let's uh, arm this so that it could be ready for recording. We arm the track, and let's test this. And right now, the sound is so low, the volume of the sound, it, it's kind of low and kind of low quality. So if you want this to go up higher uh, or have higher quality, you have to put some effects right here. I heard this, this is going to be fixed in version, in version 6 of Mixcraft. So, um, but right now, there's an alternative to that. We can go to Classic EQ and from Full Reset, we go to um uh, let's uh, let's go to boomer here boomer or we can just go to uh, full reset and edit and from the input we increase the increase this to plus eight and um and this should be fine now let's test this Alright, so let's try making a beat right now from this. Um, we can, in fact, we can increase the volume. We can, we can make this louder than this, more high, more high quality. Let's increase this to 16 plus 16. Um, so let's test this and see how it is right now. Better, much, much better. And, um, yeah, so right here we can, let's make a beat right now. Okay, let's set the project and set some metronome, make the metronome to be on. And then let's click record and start recording. Yeah, so after recording, we um, can minimize this, and here is it is sound tab, and from here we can um, fix some mistakes. If we made a lot of mistakes, uh, we can fix them, fix those here. So as you can see, uh, it seems we didn't make a lot of mistakes here, uh, but we can always, you know, push this forward to make them line to um, s snap this so that we don't have some kind of so that, so that it sounds super perfect let's fix all these here and um, yeah we can make sure they are all fixed and now we can play from play this let's play this and see You see, uh, there's kind of a problem here, 
And now we can clearly see that we have to move this forward to make it match with this line, go along with the line. So I think that's the only problem we have here right now. So let's play this again. Alright, it's perfect right now, but then we kind of need some additional instruments to put on this. Here we can add this uh, right here, the symbol. I mean, this is called hi hat, hi hat, and um, it can make your music sound much better. Let's check. Let's check how it sounds right now. You see, um, right here you can make make it cluster here to give some kind of effects and right here you start again to skip this like that add more and more more and more yeah let's let's check how it sounds now see here yep you can see the effect of that and here we can make it cluster again for a little while you can cluster here and here you start the regular I mean, irregular skipping to give it to spice it up. So let's listen to this again. Yep, and uh, we want to convert convert this into a loop. Make it a, to be a loop. Let's put this back here. I think we should first of all correct this. Pull this back here. Put it back here. Um. Let's check uh, if this can be a loop here. So make it into loop. So here we can add more loop when you click this place it adds more of this on it on this um, on the timeline it adds more of the loop here so it is it is double right now so let's check from here how it sounds nope 
it doesn't sound good there's some problem here looping this you see you see uh, we kind of need we kind of need some um, space here so let's drag this up here and see whether this can solve this, this will solve this problem let's see now we still need one more about one more additional space here so we move this forward and let's play yeah here yeah sounds much better right now except that we have to add some hi-hats to fill in this space here so let's play this again and see how it transitions yep gonna see gonna hide gonna be gonna hide all right so here we can move this back now to start from the beginning and um, that's our drum sound so let's play this without um, a metronome metronome off so let's see and we can go ahead and add some effects if you want um, reverb yep we have dozens of free effects we have a lot of uh, I'm not I'm not dozens or something like that but we have a lot of effects from Acoustica so we can always add more effects so this is our drum loop right here and we can always mix it mix it down to mp3 or any other file format uh, here from here we can mix it down to any file formats we want and thank you for watching and subscribe for more of these kind of videos this these videos will help you make your own beats and not depend on others um, to for music for, to use for your videos or important occasions or you know make your own song uh, thank you very much for watching and um, uh, I'll talk to you soon. Bye.